there's certainly a lot of evidence that diet does play a role in the quality of a man's sperm or the quality of his semen generally. Many studies have been done looking at what men eat and what they consume and comparing that with the quality of the sperm that they then ejaculate and a few things become apparent. If you look at men who eat a lot of antioxidants and compare their sperm to men who eat less antioxidants than the men who eat lots of antioxidants, all we seem to have better sperm. We can also correlate sperm quality with intake of things like zinc and things like folic acid. And there are some studies supporting selenium as being one of the important things for sperm production. Now the question is to what extent men should change their diets in order to perhaps give their sperm production a boost. That's maybe the wrong question because you can eat too much of things sometimes and not enough of other things. I think for most men a balanced healthy diet is probably what they should be looking at and they should be looking at eating their five portions of fruit and vegetables a day and they should be looking to have a balanced diet across all many different food groups. Some men find that difficult however and if a man does find it difficult or he's finding it that he doesn't have the time to eat five portions of fruit and veg a day, I'd say try and make some time, um, but in the short term certainly taking supplements and taking vitamins probably would help to fill that deficit if there's a deficit in his diet. Quite what formulation of vitamins or minerals are most appropriate I'm not sure and I don't think the jury has made a conclusion of that yet but if you know that your diet is deficient in some way or you suspect your diet is deficient in one aspect of vitamins or minerals in some way then certainly taking uh, a supplement in the three or four months prior to trying for a baby will do no harm.